Good morning, everyone. Hi, I miss you all. So I have a book that I'm going to read you today. And it's a little golden book, little golden book. And it's Toy Story 2. Do you see Woody and Buzz? I do. Toy Story 2. Do you like toys? Do you like toys? I like toys. Well, Andy sure does. He has all different kinds of toys, and he loves to play with each and every one of them. Can you find Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head? Can you find toy soldiers? Where is the ball? Do you see the ball? Can you find Woody? Where is Woody? There he is. Andy is holding Woody. And here is Buzz. But Andy's favorite toys are a cowboy named Woody. Here's the cowboy named Woody. And a space ranger named Buzz Lightyear. One day, something terrible happened. Uh-oh. Let's find out. Woody was toy snapped. <gasps> Somebody took Woody. Oh no. Who took Woody? You see, Woody wasn't just a toy. He was a famous toy who once had his own TV show. Woody was on TV. Along with Jessie the cowgirl, Bullseye the horse, and Stinky Pete the prospector, Woody starred in Woody's Roundup. That's the name of the show, Woody's Roundup. Because Woody and the other Roundup toys were so famous, Al, a greedy toy store owner, was going to sell them to a museum all the way across the world in Japan. Japan is a country far, far away. Jesse Bullseye and the Prospector were very excited. They had been in storage for a long time. So they were put away in boxes for a very long time. Nobody played with them. But Woody didn't want to go to a silly museum. He wanted to go back home to Andy. Woody wanted to stay with Andy because Andy loved him. They played together. They laughed together. They spent every day together until the girl grew up and forgot all about Jesse. Oh, that's sad. Woody began to wonder if Andy would grow up and forget about him. Do you think that Andy will forget about Woody? Maybe the museum wouldn't be so bad after all. Meanwhile, Buzz Lightyear had been busy planning a rescue mission. Buzz is going to rescue them. Buzz will save them. Mr. Potato Head, sl uh, Slinky Dog, Ham, Buzz, and Rex all set off together to find Woody. All of Woody's friends are going to save them.
To get to Al's toy barn, that's the store, the toys had to cross a busy street. Fortunately, they had a plan. Can you find the toys? Where are they? <gasps> Look. Are those the toys? They're hiding under cones, traffic cones. See, Slinky Dog, Buzz, Ham, Rex, and who's that? Inside the store, Buzz and the others had to face another challenge, a new and confused Buzz Lightyear toy. <gasps> Look, one Buzz Lightyear, two Buzz Lightyear. <gasps> and little did they know that an evil toy named Emperor Zerg was hot on their trail. Emperor Zerg. But nothing would stop Buzz and his friends from finding Woody. They quickly found Al in the office of the toy store and followed him to his apartment. Apartment is where he lives. And there was Woody. You see Woody? Jesse? But there was one problem. Woody had decided to go to the museum with the other Roundup toys. He didn't want to end up forgotten and in storage. Buzz tried to convince Woody to go home to Andy, but the cowboy had made up his mind. So Buzz and the others left without Woody. Oh no. Who will rescue Woody? Do you think that Woody will come back? Do you think Woody will go back to Andy? It didn't take Woody long to realize that he had made a mistake. His true place was with Andy, not in a museum. But the prospector had a different plan. He was going to the museum and no cowboy would stand in his way. He trapped Woody, Jesse, and Bullseye in the apartment. Then Al took them away. Oh, the prospector, prospector Pete, he is not a nice boy. Woody's friends had to rescue him, but first they had to defeat Zerg. <gasps> There's Zerg. Now they had to hurry. Al was on his way to the airport. N Next stop, Japan. Buzz Lightyear to the rescue. Buzz, Mr. Potato Head, Ham, Rex, and Slinky borrowed a car and raced to the airport. Where is the car? Do you see the car? There it is. They rescued Woody and Bullseye and sent the prospector packing. <gasps> Do you see Prospector Pete? Look, Prospector Pete is in a backpack. Unfortunately, poor Jesse got stuck on the plane. Oh no. Look, Jesse's in a suitcase and she's going on the plane. What will happen? Would Woody and Buzz be able to save her? Do you think that Woody and Buzz are going to save Jesse? Of course they would. Yeehaw! Soon Woody, Buzz, Rex, Ham, Mr. Potato Head, and Slinky were back in Andy's room, along with their new friends, Jesse and Bullseye. 
All of the toys knew they couldn't stop Andy from growing up, but they wouldn't miss it for the world. They're all back with Andy, all his friends, all his toys. The end. Thank you for listening. I'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys.